Well, how are you? How are you? It's Fox, and um, I wanted to do some freestyle, really big notebook stuff today. Aha! So, let me show you. I um, made a jacket for the Lime, Mr. Lime. So, here's Mr. Lime. Let's see if I can turn it so you can read it. I might have to flip that. I think I will. But so, yeah, I moved into this. This is, as I may have mentioned, this is my spore notebook. And I'm just going planet by planet um, with the stuff I need for the notes I need. These are all the different planets. I'm going to have to switch a couple things around. But, um, as I play each game, I fill in the special things about that particular game, and I will make a I'll make a spore video with this book another time. But what I mainly want to show you is the jacket I made for it, and this I did a while back, but I've added a couple of enhancements to it. Here's the inside again. It's just taping. I cut the pockets off and tape them to the side to make flaps. And this is a presentation folder. And so what you just do, pop it in. Pop it on over here to protect these. Protect your paperbacks. It also is not too bad as a, a bookmark, as long as you don't get too far into the book. But since it's such a big book, um, This and you kind of have to let it adjust to itself. But I added this tape here, so it looks kind of like denim denim stitching along the top. I just really think that's really pretty, and also on the on the side. So there you go. And of course, we must have our bands. This is a headband. Just pop this on. And this is handy to have too. I clip my pages as I'm playing so it stays on my planet. That I'm currently on. Also, my bag of friction pens, erasable. So I'm kind of color coding my my planets. Also, a little notebook for anything I want to write down, but doesn't really need to go into the big book. And that all goes into this nice little mesh pouch that came with, um, I bought a, uh, a, a mesh beach bag and it had this matching pouch. So that's this one. That's the first. Well, I got on a creative thing and well, I, I got two more notebooks because I think I might want to give one away and it's nice, it would be nice to have a second one. So I got orange. I have three, lime, orange, and yellow. So now I can make punch. <laughs> I haven't done anything. I just got this a couple days ago with this one. So this is a virgin. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> Love it. 
but I made this cover a while ago. I made it when I made the blue cover. And this one's kind of, it's got a little spot in the tab that is really nice the way I made it. So I can actually hook the cover into one, one little corner of the cover can go in. But this is, um, again, this is a presentation folder with some um, decorative tape. This is glossy, I mean sparkly, glitter, glittery black tape that I added to cover up some spots that I didn't want to have show. This also has some hole punches in it, but they're just, they're perforated. They're not actually punched out. So I'm just leaving them alone. So I just pop the jacket over the book. And this is the end, I don't think that, okay. Now this has a little lip that I can hook it into, which is really nice. Have a really snazzy pink camo notebook <laughs> and another headband. It's got um, it's kind of ribbed, so it's like pink and black ribs. So then we do this like that. And we be styling. But I have three really big notebooks now. Yes, we got a little <laughs> three children. And here's Lemon. Lemon is also a virgin. <laughs> so again, uh, so nice, so nice. And for Lemon, we're going to do we're going to make a jacket today for lemon, like this. So it's going to look kind of nice that it matches, you know, the colors match, but it doesn't matter because it covers the whole thing. You're not going to see the other color, but so there we go. And a, uh, another headband. Okay, I think I got about everything I need. I've got some wide transparent tape. Not sure if I'll need it, but I'll have it. And narrow transparent tape. Some washi. Washi one. It's just some sort of um, plasticky feeling yellow tape and some more washi. Oops. Oh, come on. There. Then I thought, you know, these might be cute somewhere like when somewhere that I attached the flaps to the jacket, I would say. And I got of course my all important scissors. And a pencil. So, let's see, what are we doing? It? Let's um, trace first.
to save your pieces because they're going to come in handy for something. Definitely save the flaps. So let's get the flaps off. Don't, and don't, don't mess them up. Uh, let's see. I think. Okay, so now I'm going to add the flaps, but I want to make them a little nicer, so we'll do this, just so they're symmetrical. Oh, excuse me. Slide it into the back one. Okay. And then bring the front around.
Okay. It fits. It fits, but it needs adjusting. So we're going to I told you, don't you don't throw away your extra pieces. <laughs> so we're probably we're gonna do a little bit of a a splice, I think. Yes. Just to make it all, you know, look a little nicer. bit I want to do up here. A little structure. Not bad, not bad. You like it? It's pretty, huh? I think it's pretty. So now we're gonna um, finish it with some some pretty tape. That See, we still have some tape left over. This is the front. There 
Here's the bottom edge. Top edge. There is your freestyle really big notebook. In a jacket. There we go. Freestyle really big notebooks with jackets. Don't forget your jacket. It's cold outside. Good night.